Hey everyone. A while back I made a video about a random drum sequencer I was making with the Arduino. Well, I made it into an Arduino shield and have even used it at a few shows with my EMX. Not too long ago, I got this uh, Volca Beats and hadn't done anything with it. So I thought, what would happen if I reprogrammed it to work with the Volca Beats? And that's what I did. So the center knob uh, is still being used for kind of the busyness of the uh, random sequence. So if it's all the way to the left, it's not going to trigger anything. And if it's all the way to the right, it's going to trigger every 16th note. And in between kind of dials in. Uh, what else it's going to trigger. So if I turn it up a little bit, you hear it starting to hit some notes. Uh, to the right is our tempo. Uh, so this is kind of a slow tempo right now. And here's our velocity. So up here, um, most of it is going to be full velocity notes. And when I turn it down, you'll hear some of the notes get quieter. And every once in a while, there's a is a louder note. So uh, this had to be redone using the part levels because the Volca is not velocity sensitive with MIDI. So that wasn't a big deal. Uh, it was pretty easy to do. This is still my double time knob. Uh, and uh, over here previously I had a switch to turn it off but um, when I realize I can stop the sequence just by turning the probability all the way down, I decided to do something different with the switch. And what I ended up doing was making it so if this is switched on, it will um, randomly change things like the PCM speed, the tom decay, the hi-hat uh, grain, and decays. Um, which are the only things that are available over MIDI. So if you turn it on You end up getting quite a bit of a different sound and if you turn the tempo up a bit You end up kind of getting a cool little glitch machine Yeah, so this is fun. I think I'm gonna add some more stuff, like uh, also being able to turn on and off some stutter randomization. I think that'd be fun. So this is definitely opening up some cool possibilities. Uh, after I recorded that explanation, I played around with it a bit more and was really amazed at the variety of sounds I could get just from tweaking the Volca and sequencer settings. So uh, I also added in um, some stutter randomization and that even brought the glitch level up higher. So uh, you can find a download to the Arduino project in the description, which includes lots of comments, including how to wire uh, the thing up. And if you like this project or you think it's something you'd be interested in purchasing, leave a comment. I'm considering building a prototype uh, with way more features, including MIDI in for clock and finer control. That's all for now. See you next time.